Hey guys, how's it going? How's life? I don't want to do an intro like everybody else. I want this to be as real as possible. If you don't like it, don't like it. Don't watch it. It's it, it's whatever. You know, I, oh, I want to talk about someone else too. I feel like with my last couple videos, I've been fake. And when I'm saying I've been fake, my voice. I don't talk like that, y'all. I talk like this. So, from this point on, we gonna be real with each other, okay? Today, we are going to talk about hair oils. I rave about hair oils. If you were to give me one product left on earth, it's gonna be in hair oil. So today I'm gonna to rate oils from one to five, one being the worst, five being the best. A couple of products that I use every so often, something that I do, something I rave about, tell you why I like it, why I dislike it, what I think they can do better with their products. So here we go. The first one is gonna be Organics Coconut Miracle Oil. This oil, I used to think it was my favorite oil, maybe because I've used it the longest and I kept rebuying it. If you rebuy something, you obviously like it, right? Well, this one I felt like was good enough for me and my needs, but I definitely give it a three out of five. The consistency is kind of thick. I don't like anything thick from makeup to hair to anything. I don't, I don't like thick things. And, I, and this one, um, you do have to open the top and that's something that does bother me because I... I don't like stuff on my hands, so I have to rub it in my hands to put it in there. That's something I, I don't like doing, so that's kind of why I put the rating where it's at. I will say that it's good and it's nice and silky in my hair. It does go through very nicely. Um, I Another thing I do like is they do recycle their bottles. The reason why I feel like this brand is good is because they don't test on animals. If you know me or if, you are, if you're on my Instagram, you know I don't like any products that test on animals. I ain't no PETA person, but I definitely believe that animals have feelings. I definitely feel like they have a purpose on earth. Are you gonna go test on your brother? Some harsh chemical that might grow another arm? No, you're not, so. One of my favorite brands of life is Shea Moisture. The Shea Moisture Omega 369 Protectant Oil Serum. So it's really a heat protectant. Um, but I don't follow the rules clearly. I would say this is a two out of five. Why? I don't know if it's just my oil or if it's everybody's oil, but this bad boy, when you spray it, it just strings one string and I like something that bursts out. So this one only string like sprays one string. That's, I don't like that. I love the brand. I love everything about the brands. I love that they're black owned. I love that they um, have good ingredients i love they are also cruelty free those are a lot of things that i love about this oil one thing i do not like is the spray and i don't like how thick this is so with this one i have to because it only sprays in one spot i have to put it in my hand and rub it through don't like that and i don't like how thick maybe i should just only use it when i'm straightening my hair who knows but i don't like that product Next one is Carol's Daughter. Carol's Daughter is black vanilla oil. They started investing in my hair. Carol's Daughter was the number one brand that I started with. Yes, it's a little more, little more um, coins you gotta drop, but it's, it's worth it. This one is definitely a five out of five. Um, I like the spritzer, that's what it's called. I like the spritzer, it definitely flumes out. It smells amazing. Honestly, those are probably the only benefits why I like it is because of the spritzer the smell of it and it's a good weight to my hair. I honestly put it in at night when I'm putting on my scarf in the morning. I smell amazing and my hair is still a little bit hydrated. So good job, Kale's daughter. This is a fairly new brand to myself and I will say I am highly obsessed with them. I wrote a blog post about it. I raved about it. I told my sisters about it. If I find something new, I'll tell my sister. Um, her, if I find something new and I love it, I tell my sister because her daughter's hair is extremely dry. So a lot of products don't work with hair and hair. But this one right here, happy curls, happy girls, five out of five. This one, you do have to put it in your hands. But most of the products that I do use, I do use it dry and my hair is dry. But this one in particular, I like to use it when my hair is wet because it keeps it hydrated. So I think that's kind of something I need to do too so I can stop getting people low ratings is I need to start using these oils with my hair wet. But I feel like everything drips off. So that's why I don't like to do it. I don't like to waste money and I feel like that's wasted money on top of that. So five out of five for them. I can pronounce everything in here. People who use natural resources to make things, 
you're gonna win my heart automatically. If it's organic, if it's natural and not tested on animals, I'm gonna buy it hands down. If you have good stuff, I'm gonna buy it. This one I highly recommend to anybody. It's affordable, you don't need much, and just get it, just believe me. Just believe what I'm saying to you right now. Lastly, praise Jesus, let's hope I say this name right. Old John's Rare Blend Oil. One out of five. Honestly, hate it. It is so thick. If I have to mix something, I'm not gonna do it. I don't like I have to put this one in my hand, and it's so thick in my hair. Um, it has a decent smell. I just I don't care for it. I don't know where this thing came from, but y'all can have it back. I I just don't like this oil. I thought I would like this oil. People were talking about this oil. Some lady told me I needed this oil. I didn't need the oil. The oil is not for me. That being said, I hope you guys listen to what I have to say. If you don't, oh well, fuck it. It is what it is. But I really want to keep continue to talk about my experiences with hair products because I do use a lot of hair products quite often. I get a lot of hair products. I love doing reviews on products. My honest review. Nobody's truly paying me to say anything like this. I want to be honest with people because I want people to be honest with me. And I feel like everybody's going to say the same thing because we're paid to say those things i'm gonna be real with you guys like if i don't like something i don't like it and i'll tell you why i don't like it i'm not gonna bash the brand or anything like that because all these brands i do love like i do love old john i do love shane moisture i do like carol's daughter as well as everything else i have talked about today but there's certain things that just doesn't work for me and if you have a different type of hair than i do then it might work for you it just it depends on you you as a person um, and I have a 3B type of hair, so it might work better for a 4A. I don't know, but hopefully you'll take my word and what I have to say and buy these products. I'll see you later.